Well, good morning and welcome back to the Great Dane Channel. We're here, uh, got some great clips of Reggie, Reggie! Reggie's trying to get the kitties. So I got magic Reggie. Hey guys, I gotta deal with Reggie. Okay, we had to have Reggie go in a little time out in his house. Um, but today I'm gonna be talking to you about the gentle leader. Um, Finn has a problem where he... Don't want a goofy poodle with a pedigree. No whiny, wimpy little Magic. pooch, don't you see? A great big dog's the only one for me. Then I'll be doing all right. Well, I got him back when he was just a bum. Way back then, I can pick him up. Now he barely fits into my pickup truck. Yeah, that's what he's doing. doing all right. Magic's got it. And it's a great time. Uh, has a problem where he pulls on the chain. And I'm using the um, choke chains. And so that can put excess pressure on their trachea. So I thought I would give it a try. So PetSafe is a great partner of the brand. They own Kurgo. Um, and they have given me the uh, training collar that I use on the dogs. And so now I, uh, they provided me with the gentle leader and I'm going to show you how those work. It comes with a leash and with the nose band and neck halter. And I already have fit these for both the dogs. This is a magic. So come over here. You're good. So we go like this. Come on. We get his nose in like this, and it's pretty loose here, guys. And then we come up behind his neck and clip it in. And now he can he can fully open his mouth if needed. And I've got just this little leash, and this leash, wherever this goes, the head goes, okay? And what I do to get them trained on it is I put this halter on and then I leave it. So for being such a good dog, no fin. Back up. You don't have yours on yet. You get that for being a good boy. Good. One of the things they said to do is they put the treat right here so they... Come on. Here, Finn. Easy as that. So you can see it hooks up behind their head. This one's actually pretty loose. I can tighten that up a little bit. And then the nose band is also pretty loose. We'll show you that in a minute. But now they're ready for their walk. Let's see how this goes. Oh, the other thing I wanted to mention is this comes with a complete training uh, pamphlet. Shows you how to put it on, as well as all the different tips for how to train them. So pretty thorough, and it comes with a DVD. I just don't know where I would play a DVD. Okay hook you up to the halter and go from there. Okay, they're wagging their tail. At first they don't like it and it bothers them. So you see them try and get it off because they're just not used to it. So we do it in short little five minute increments. Finn, come here. Hi, come here, Finn. And we'll just walk outside with them. Ready? Look at that. Sit. Got it? Yep. Thanks, honey. Okay. Sit. Sit. Stay. I know they look a little, stay. They look a little bit silly at first, but I can tell you that you totally have control of their head without any pressure on their neck, which is great. Stay. <sighs> okay, heel. Heel, heel. Good boys. Stay. They're fighting it right now, but they'll chill, they'll relax and chill out and get used to it. Come. 
Have a great day. Heel. Hey, heel. Finn, stop fighting it. Good boys. We're walking. Come on. If you get them walking, they're distracted and everything is good. This way. Heel. Heel. Come on. Finn. Finn. There we are. See, they want to try and wipe it off, but they'll quickly learn they can't get it off. Magic's already stopped fighting it. Finn, it's okay, Finn. What do you got, Finn? Want to smell something? I'm thinking of it like a halter. When my daughter saw the picture or the video of the dog, she was asking the same question. Sit, Finn. Good boy. Oh, and they're gonna get a nice treat when we take these off. In the house. Finn, sit. Good boy. Magic, sit. Good boy. It's bedtime and they're just resting. Good boys. Yeah, Magic says just leave me alone with my new bark box stuff. thing I came over here and here's where Finn's decided he wants to lay down Finn it doesn't even cover half your body get on your bed you want to stay there you can stay there magic's kind of taking multiples we got an extra one here and Reggie's just laying around oh Finn you're so silly Go lie down. Hey guys, sometimes you just have to remember that Great Danes just want to be loved and loved on and magic comes around and reminds me of that all the time down here in the in the workroom, but I mean, you just got to pet them and enjoy them. I don't always, I don't always remember to do that for the old boy. And you got to do that. He's such a good boy. You are. I love you so much. Hey guys, so that's the uh, pet safe gentle leader, which honestly I sort of laughed at and ridiculed for years because I was stuck in my ways about a training collar. So I really am going to give this a try. My early indications are it's a very nice quality product. The dogs already are tolerating it reasonably well. And if we are on a walk with another dog, I can get pressure on them to not go after the dog by just leading their head instead of their, their throat where damage could occur. So I, uh, I'll put a link in the description where you can get these and um, definitely check them out. I think they're gonna be a nice addition and maybe remove some of the stress I experience when taking the boys on a walk. So I hope you enjoyed it, check them out. Have a great day. Great day in the neighborhood. Why can't every dog be just as good?